Developing now, police make an arrest in the death of a 22-year-old NC State alum from Thomasville. Raleigh police say a 19-year-old is charged with Cody McGlagan's death. He was shot in a grocery store parking lot. It's just very heartbreaking just to hear about this to happen. He was very driven, you know, and um, he had a lot of plans. He was a good guy. He was the guy you could always go to if you needed something. Tonight, his friends are still trying to come to terms with the recent college graduate's death. He was gunned down just as he was starting out life on his own. WI News 2's Avery Powell shares how they're remembering him tonight. I spoke with several of Cody McLagan's childhood friends today, all of them telling me the 22 year old from Thomasville was a genuinely good person. And in his passing, they want him to be remembered for his positive, helping spirit. You know, he just has a, a, a face that's naturally uh, smiling, just a bit, bit, big smile. Very loving, very caring, like he always showed love. Just a good dude to be around, you know. That's how childhood friends of Cody McLagan describe the 22-year-old Thomasville native who was shot and killed Friday in Raleigh. He was probably my first uh, friend. Uh, on this earth. Walker Covington met Cody in preschool and said he would go with his family on vacation. He was a good guy. He was the guy you could always go to if you needed something or needed someone to talk to or needed to get something done or needed help with something. And throughout the years, the connection didn't end. He was always going to be my best man. Um, but uh, now nah, he can't, you know, but it's still kind of like hard to believe. At Friendship Elementary, Cody met Braxton White. The two formed a fast connection, even sharing the same birthday. I, I just, I don't think I ever saw him be mean to anyone. It was never anything but nice. So. Then at Ledford Middle School, another impactful friendship. I didn't really feel like I was like fitting in very well. But then Cody came up to me, he was like, hey, dear, like, don't worry about anything. Just be yourself, be you. People will love who you are. A positive light, one his friends hope will live on. You know, I just hope one day if I ever have a kid, um, they can have a fraction of his personality. Avery Powell, WFMY News 2.